Hello. I want to say something loud and clear. I'm not speaking for all children of stay-at-home mothers, okay? But I'm going to speak for myself because I had a stay-at-home mother. Yeah, some of us had it. And I also had a dad who paid all the bills. Oh, yeah, I'm pausing. Oh, yeah, there are some men that do it. And I had a father that did it with five children, I might add. So let me tell you something. My mother told us girls, her daughters, to be independent. And guess what? To never depend on a man. So for those people who are now devastated, you can remain devastated because you have created a jail cell in your brain. What do I mean by that? Being independent does not mean you don't need a man, silly. It means that you are not getting up in the morning, resting all your hopes on this one person. Got it? For those women who think that being independent means you don't need a husband, that is not the message that she gave us. I do not carry that message. Not that you asked me, but I'm just sharing this. So I want to redirect the conversation. And why am I like this, incognito like this, so to speak? It's the mood I'm in. It is what it is. I want to change the direction of the conversation from these extremes, from either you're independent or you're dependent. You don't know what it's like to lose your husband. And you don't know anything about paying bills. You've never worked in your life. You don't have a degree. Nobody is talking about anything in a realistic manner. These men who are getting up, who woke up one day, and got the revelation that women should be stay-at-home mothers and all this stuff need to just back up a little bit. And the women that are walking with them need to take a breather. It is not that cut and dry. There is absolutely everything right about an educated woman. She can stay at home and teach her children if she wants to. She can even homeschool them because she's educated. She can have an at-home business if she wants to. So let's get rid of this idea that either you're a feminist, either you're a dependent person, either you're this or that. We get to make choices in 2023 about the kind of women that we want to be. And I'm happy with that. I'm very, very happy with that. 